Hello, and welcome to another episode of Curse of Strahd, here on Dork Tales. <laughs> Sorry, you went three, two, one, right as I was starting a sneeze, and I couldn't say anything to stop, and you just clicked it. I was like, shit! <laughs> um, check your gain real quick. What about it? Uh, just you're coming a little echoey. Are you still on the same setting? You're still on the same everything? Yep, I haven't touched anything. Christine right. doesn't change settings. <laughs> All right. I don't. I don't fuss with them. All right. Let's uh, let's rewind. Ready? Okay. Let's start that again. Ready? Three, two. Good evening and welcome to Curse of Strahd, episode. I mean, chapter fourteen. <laughs> I was trying to be classy, and I ruined it with that episode thing. Uh, hello, and welcome to Curse of Strahd, Chapter 14, here on Dork Tales. I'm your storyteller slash dungeon master. I can't get any of these things straight tonight. Damn! All right. Who wants to be straight? A full moon. Welcome to Curse of Strahd. <laughs> I'm... <laughs> I'm Strahd von Zarevich, the fantastic <laughs> ruler of this land. No. Um, well, then Strahd go loses... <laughs> go on. Strahd loses his immune... Or, pardon me, his vulnerability to fire if he's flaming, though, right? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I'm, just, I, I'm sorry. I've just reinvented Strahd in my head as, like, an 80s gay man from, like, an 80s movie where he's like... I may be I may be weak to crosses, but those drapes are even worse. You know, it's just like no, why? It's great, I love it. It's basically like Harvey Weinstein, Harvey Weinstein, the the guy from Mrs. Doubtful. You know, the one who talks like this. Firestein. Firestein. Thank you, thank you. Fine. Firestein or Feinstein? Anyway, that guy. But I like, just have him as a rent. Hey, boss. Maybe we should go pick up some hot boys. You know, like get some dances in these cages. You know. That'd be good. Anyway, that'll stay on Twitch. <laughs> God damn it. Strahd at the Odyssey. Like, Jesus. What? I said Strahd at the Odyssey. <laughs> <laughs> this would be the best campaign. I don't know what this you're talking about. I love that guy. Because also, Blazarevich does sound reasonably convincing like it could be a fashion label. Like, <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Someone clip this, all of this. <laughs> Strahd's. Amy, that's your job. Fashion. I know it is. I don't know how to do it, so it's your job. It also sounds like it should be pronounced with a really kinky German accent, like, Guten Tag. I am Strahd, Strahd von Zarovich, ruler of Barovia. So the mustache ride accent. <laughs> Who wants a bat ride? <laughs> I'm a really bat boy. Anyway. Uh, okay, then. That is a very different introduction to Curse of Strahd than I think you expected. All right, let's just, let's rewind that one more time. Bringing it back, bringing it back. Oh, God. See, this is the this is the beauty of watching us on Twitch, because I cut most of this stuff out for, for YouTube. Because people on YouTube are like, they just want pictures of Spider-Man and just to watch. But on Twitch, y'all are cool. You're, you're hip, you're with it. And you can tell us to shut the hell up anytime. You can't Will we? Not that we'll necessarily listen. No, but you but can. There, you have some you agency. You need an outtake roll. That mm -hmm. reminds me, I gotta update that outtake reel because <laughs> I, I love it. We keep um, on Rhyme of the Frost Maiden. We keep having um, some technical difficulties, and so in episode one on YouTube, it cuts from Hayden. Hayden, are you there? <laughs> <laughs> to well, if it's good enough for a donkey, it's good enough for you. <laughs> like no context. It's just so good. And the second one, like, Robin had, like, 20 minutes of nothing. And then we just talked about wigs and cosplay for 20 minutes. And I'm, I am cut that because I knew that someone would be, like, too many girls. I already did that, though, so why bother? I uh, also, well, we made a lot of fun of him, so I've got to repost that, too. Also, also, Stu, you'll be happy to know something. Oh, wait. No, sorry. That. that there we go. All right. Rats. What would an exclamation point be? I like that we even pulled that into Hayden's stream the other day. It was amazing. Well, and Hayden keeps you sent me this video that's like rats, rats, we're the rats of this like awful like CG from like 1990. 
Well, <laughs> Stu, rats are historical. You're you're in the future. Don't worry about it. You're fine. Things turn out okay. Trust me. We're from the past. Um, <laughs> Trust me. In, in, in the, the next five about. seconds. Uh, you're fine. So I guess before we we start from zero again, I just want to ask everybody how your Schadenfreude is doing, because mine's pretty good, uh, given current global headline news. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry. I don't mean to spill the tea. The tea's been spilt, Chief. The tea's... That's it. You're canceled. Like <laughs> I thought I was the Am I canceled? No, no, it's a rep. It is... I'm sorry, I've been looking at too many prequel memes. <laughs> <laughs> Stepping the tea. That's it. You're canceled and that's it, Chief. Anakin. <laughs> Anakin. Obi Wan said you were killing the younglings, and you were. What? No, and Padme. I was in mid bay the whole time. I was in mid bay the whole time. <laughs> Kenobi's acting really sus. <laughs> oh god! All right, all right, guys. So let us start. Oh. Chris of Strahd, ready? Here's the clapper, and. <sighs>